In this video, I'm gonna talk about the best team to use in tier two in Plano Online so that you could compete with the comp players on Plano Online. And not only that, to help you win games. All right, the reason why I put the Grizzlies because John Morant is so different is that he is so nice in this game. He could dribble the ball like crazy and he moves so fast with the silver quick first step. I don't know how, but this dude right here could shoot. He got an 83 ball. It could, you could really go off with this man anytime. So y'all need help to win games? Play with the Grizzlies, I'm telling you. They won't let you down, all right? And not only that, they got Brooks, a guy that could guard the best player on the team. And also, they got Jared Jackson, the guy that could shoot the three ball and play defense. And he got some of the defensive badges like a bronze and silver. So he able to guard the, the best player or best power forward in the league in this game. And you got the newest member, Steven Adams, the guy that could play defense, block shots, rebound. And he set a good screen with the best point guard in the NBA. So he really, he really good at that. So make sure you use screens wisely and make sure you all ball a little bit to play defense with Steven Adams. And don't be afraid to throw a lob to him because he will catch it and dunk it. All right, so he'll be a good guy to stop or slow down best centers in the game. Yeah, the Hawks are one of the best team in tier two to use because you're able to win games with them because they got shooters around all over the court. And sometimes you can put John Collins at the five so that you want to five out with Trey Young. So that would be deadly if you know how to five out. I already got the video to explain that. So if you miss it, you could check it out. But with Trey Young, you could dance with this guy. He got he got that one of the best ball handlers in the game. Like his hesitation is so lethal, it's really hard to guard that, especially with, if the guy using the pick. So make sure you use your pick wisely with Trey Young. And that way you go open up for the shooter. So just in case the defense collapse, you could kick it out to the corner or somebody that's open because Trey Young is so so lethal, is that it's really hard to guard him. Also, you gotta be careful if you play with that team because it's gonna be a lot of mirror matches because everybody's a fan of Trey Young. He's like a baby version of Steph Curry. You know, Steph Curry is the master and Trey Young is the student. The only difference is, is that Trey Young moves faster than Steph Curry. So that's the only difference. But this team's fun to use. I'm gonna go with Dallas because this team is most versatile to use. And just in case a guy all ball you, you could put you could put Paul Zingas at the five so that you could ISO him and you could five out against the guy that all balls a lot. All right, so make sure you use that team wisely. And not only that, try to use Luca a lot because he's so good is that he got a range extender on goal. He had go on quick first step, so he got able to move fast. And he got a lot of good hesitation. He could do a step back. He can make you fall. And speaking of falling, he got the shot career that makes you fall. So make sure you cross people up and break ankles with this guy. Cause this guy is so OP and I'll, and I'll blame the 2K to give him a highest overall. He should be a 96 overall the way he plays, not 94. Cause that's kind of disrespectful. Cause he's too talented in offense. He's like a what? Baby Larry Bird, they call him. So, and not only that, you got Ten Holloway, the guy that can shoot a three ball and he can slash to the rim as well. And you got Finney Smith, a guy that could guard the best player on the team. He's not perfect at it, but he could slow you down. He could slow them down sometimes, but not like that. So he's your best option to use him against defense. And not only that, you could use Bobon as a starting five just in case the guy don't all ball. So you want to use him for height and get rebounds, and you're able to block shots because he's 7'5". He's very tall. Oh man, you cannot go wrong with this team. You have to use the Blazers. If you need like one more game left to move up to the next league, use this team because this team will not let you down. Because Dame Dollar is one of the cheesiest point guards in the video game. He could get an animation contact dunks. He, he got a long range, range extended from the three point line and he could dribble the ball, got nice hesitation moves. Like, it's really hard to guard that. So, and not only that, Nurkish is a center that has a three-point as a 75 attribute. So you're able to green that in this game because like the community says, it's easy to shoot greens in this game, which is the fact. So I hope they don't pass it. They might pass it, I don't know, cause it's gonna be a lot of complaints, but the game is cool. So at any way, like I said, 
If you need a, a guaranteed W, use this team wisely, man. You're gonna need them to win games, okay? Because you get able to five out with them if they start to off ball you, because it's gonna happen if they see you dribbling like crazy. All right, fellas and ladies? Oh, y'all thought that I'm not gonna talk about the Bulls, right? Yes, I am. I'm gonna tell you why. Because you got two slashes in the team. You got Zach Levine and you got DeMar DeRozan. So those are the two slashes that could get their dunks every time. It's only one problem though. They don't got no on-ball defense. So at the end of the day, just use these guys as offense because they're so great at offense. They could do what they want to do. And all of that, I know y'all tired of me saying this, but you, you could also five out with this team too as well. I know people are not gonna like it, but I don't care. And I know y'all don't care either. Y'all here to be a savage, not be nice. But anyway, like I said, Zach Levine is a monster in Duncan. DeMar DeRozan is a monster at Duncan, so I don't know how you're going to stop these two guys and slash it to the rim. And not only that, they can shoot too. DeMar DeRozan, he got a mid-range, but not a three-pointer, but you could time it and green it, all right? So 